What you see on the screen is I have placed two text boxes that I have called text part 1 and text part 2. Uh, you can see I also have placed a checkbox that I have called uh, COD. Alright, we're going to change very briefly here. We're going to change the uh, hint for the checkbox and say uh, cash on delivery. Make that a question for people to answer. So this could be roughly analogous to products, whatever. We're going to join text part 1 to text part 2 as well as the state of the checkbox and then we will email that uh, to an address. So I'm going to uh, add a an activity starter that will be the receiver for our uh, mail 2 that we're going to build. We'll build a mail 2 that includes uh, these pieces of text and then that activity starter will be what mails it. Um, the action that we're going to be placing will be placed in the action as well as the data URI. But we're not going to do that here in the properties component. No, we're going to do that programmatically in the blocks editor. Our last action will be to place a button to do the dirty deed. We'll call that button send form. Um, and we'll name that button send button. Keep everything clean on the blocks editor. All right, now that's everything we need to concatenate this text, build a mail to link, and send it using an activity starter. Uh, next, we need to add the logic to do that. All right, guys, I apologize. I'm too tired to talk much tonight, but I'll walk you through this code. I built it uh, so I wouldn't have to talk through it and then um, I'll just uh, show you what happens here. I've defined two variables body text and URI text. Now you wouldn't necessarily need to do this. I've done this so that we can watch them. For the activity starter action I set the android.intent.action.view that's the uh, intent on the device that will take our data URI then I said to set the global of the body text that's what I want the body of the email to be I said to make a text out of text part 1 and text part 2 with a mime code carrier return or new line the percent 0 a is a mime code new line so text part 1 text new line, text part 2 text, new line, and then the um, checkbox value as well. So this make text block will uh, concatenate all of that text and place it in the body text, which you can see as I hover over that watch there, uh, it's done. I have my phone connected in some nonsense characters in there, GFDHJ and then AHGFD, and then I have the checkbox checked. Then I use the set global URI text variable I've defined and I say to set this variable to the value of um, text um, and once again I'm using a make text block uh, uh, mail to colon and then the email address I want to send the email to followed by a question mark question mark is very important and then I tell um, at the end of that to add subject Android form at the end of that then I use this join block to join the body tag body equals 
the content of the body text. Then I tell the activity starter data URI to take the contents of the global URI text which as we can see is mail to jwtyler at gmail.com question mark subject equals android form body equals gfdhj new line hgfd new line true so we do that that creates the body text and then we build the uri we pass that to the activity starter and away we go. Good luck, guys.